welcome thank you for always stopping by i appreciate you thank you so so much thank you today let's talk about in fact i am making this video because um i have a lady who has been confiding in me today she called again this lady this lady moved into a house with two cars like she was doing well it's not about the cars someone may not even have a car but they are doing well someone may have one car but they are doing well so it's not about the car this lady was doing well when i mean well she moved into this house with two good cars before you know it things began to go down one problem or the other she sold these two cars eventually she still managed to buy another one in the house she still sold this car now she's virtually living like hand to mouth she does not even have money to pack out of this house that this is somebody that came into a house with a multi-millionaire you understand but today she cannot even afford money to even pack out from the house now there are a lot of people who experience things like this number one number one it may not be from the house that is why we always need to keep our hands clean do no evil to only anyone wish no one evil and all that because the fact that you moved into a house doing well maybe you may have done something to someone duped someone or whatever and they you understand they lay a curse on you maybe things begin to go back you say it's the house you rented it may not be but if you observe and know that oh it is since i moved to this house my business has been going down nothing to show for it things have been going from worse to worse you understand then this spiritual exercise is for you you understand number one thing i want to always encourage us is to always pray especially before you rent a house seek the face of god seek the face of god before you rent a house very very important now some of us just because oh this house is very close is very near to the road is very um motorable this that 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 this is the only reason why we just pay, pay for a house it shouldn't be that way seek the face of god before you pay for a house it's very important thank you regardless of whether the house you move into you are doing well or not you can always do this all you need to do is i have taught us how to use um to pour sugar on the ground and pray to god and say i will attract the goodness of this land this land will connect me to with other lands this land will connect me with the goodness in other countries do you know that spiritually lands are interconnected it doesn't matter if your blessing is in abuja if your blessing is in jamaica if your blessing is in us you can use the sand or oh, sorry sugar we are not talking of that also. you can use sugar pour it on the ground and say from today let me begin to eat attract sugar or honey let me begin to eat or attract the goodness of this land and let this land go to the land of jamaica america us canada begin to every of my era that is blessing that is in those countries and land let them begin to locate me anyhow one way or the other they could locate you through your business they could locate you through someone it doesn't matter it is god that knows how they will locate you but it's very important just take sugar and eh, sugar or honey pour it on the ground and pray you are connecting with sweetness so these are just natural spiritual exercise that works effectively by the grace of god then secondly i have taught us how to also use um sugar or honey to wash your leg and pour the water on the ground with the land where you find yourself and say from today my leg my head my head my leg will take me to good places where favor will you understand these are natural spiritual exercises today i am here to talk about how you can use sand calories and salt to pray speak the power lies in the tomb there is power of life and death in your tomb call upon god almighty and say god whatever evil that is done in this house hmm? it is not my portion because i was not there i am not in agreement with whatever evil 
that um, was done in my back, in my absence. From today, I disconnect myself. I'll tell you how to do it. From today, I disconnect myself. From today, every evil of backwardness that people will uh, rent a house, they will not progress. As I am in this rented apartment, or before you rent it, even if you have paid, or you're already living in it, you have lived there for 10 years, 2 years, 1 year, 5 months, do this spiritual exercise with faith. And I tell you, by the grace of God, you will see a great change. I remove myself from what I don't know. I was not there. Whatever evil that is affecting the occupants of this house, in this house, I will build my own house. In this house, I will bear my own children. In this house, I will buy my cars. In this house, this, 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 this. You understand? I hope you understand what I'm trying to say. That is spiritually exonerating yourself. Take the sand. Some people will say, okay, the whole house is interlocked. The whole compound is interlocked. This, that, that, that. Let me chip something. Let me become your architecture small. For those of you that want to build personal houses, I beg, learn to live small, just small portion. Maybe where you will plant one small flower, where there will be sand. You understand? Just small, carve it out a little, so that you have sand, direct soil from the ground. You need to take sand from the house you built to pray or do anything. You can go there. Don't interlock everywhere. Even in a person don't go see where you go collect small sand, but. For those in rented apartments, yes, everywhere is interlocked right. If you can step outside the house, um, outside, the owner cannot interlock the house. I don't know, Sha, but outside the house, that is if there is no sand in the compound. But if there is sand in the compound, take sand. Put it in your hand. Take salt. Put it in your hand. Take cowrie. Take cowrie. Please make sure you are using original cowrie. Very important not all this um this is original calories you can see it with me it has male and female anyone you have if it's this one or the female is fine just take calorie calorie is a symbol of wealth a symbol of money put it on this the little sand and salt you have on you now call upon god the creator that was not created call upon god almighty and say god it is your will that i prosper it is your will that i excel Father, whatever evil that has been troubling anyone that you understand, you know what to say. From today, I remove myself from that evil. Hold this hand, close your mouth. From today in this house, I will progress. From this house, I will build my own house. From this house, I will have my own children. This day, 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 you know what you are believing God. Do this often, as often as you can. When you are done speaking with the soil, the sand of that land, that house, that house rather, eh? With the calories, just go and pour it away. Now, the first three times you want to do this spiritual exercise, if you can, use calories. But if you don't have calories, fine. The, the first three, you can use calories. Subsequently, you can do it without calories if you don't have calories. I don't know if you understand. The first three times, if you can get calories, use do it with calories. After, subsequently, it's just a spiritual exercise you can be doing always. Subsequently, you can just take sand and salt and, and put it in your hand. Speak and pray. From today, I will be blessed in this house. From today, I will progress. From today, I will this, that, 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 that. I, oh, God will help us. When you are done speaking, just go and pour it outside. Do this spiritual prayer, spiritual exercise continuously. And watch the creator that was not created arise and liberate you from whatever it is you do not know. Watch the creator that was not created arise and bless you in a rented apartment. And from there, by the grace of God, you will own your own house. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate you. It's none other person but Gloria Chizio. Thank you. Thank you.